Yes, of course, just when you thought that the trade deadline was over and these Pierre-Luc Dubois rumors were going to be laid to rest, Elliot Friedman comes out of nowhere, farts into a lighter, and creates chaos amongst fans of the Montreal Canadiens and the Winnipeg Jets. So let's rip the band-aids off this one and see what he had to say this time, quote, The Jets have discussed with the Canadians about Dubois, we know that Dubois will end up there at 95%. Whoa, 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 whoa. So let's stop right there and pump the brakes a bit. 95% Friedman, really? Jeez, man, that's, that's a pretty high chance. I've never seen percentages that high in my life. But he does seem pretty confident that this is going to happen. And to be completely honest with you, I think it's going to happen at some point as well. So the big question right now is when <laughs> and how. And I'm going to give you my thoughts on this because I know there's a lot of Habs fans out there. They've got a dream. They're going to wait until Dubois hits free agency and then sign him up without losing any assets but I, I just don't see this happening not anymore and here's why okay number one the Jets are in shambles right now they're not gonna want to lose this guy for none because that would be stupid and number two if you really want him I mean who's to say with 100% certainty that Pierre-Luc Dubois hits free agency and signs with the Canadians anyway uh maybe when that little piggy hits the market some team comes out of nowhere and offers the deal of a lifetime this happens out of time so i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna predict that the canadians do go out and acquire this guy before he hits free agency i think they're probably gonna have a contract lined up before he even gets a chance to pack his bags and he's gonna come home and be a fan favorite for many years now as for what it's gonna take to make this happen i mean me and Gary were kind of locking horns and talking about this yesterday. And this is what we came up with, okay? There's just so many young defense prospects that the Canadians have right now. They're all not going to make it. There's not even going to be room enough for all of them to make it. It's a complete traffic jam. So we got a feeling that it only makes sense to add one of these guys to any deal that lands a guy like Pierre-Luc Dubois. And I know it's going to suck letting one of these guys go. Now, Gary did mention a package to me yesterday of Norlander and the second round pick straight up for Pierre-Luc Dubois. Huh? I'd pull the trigger on this one, but would you and would the Jets? I've also seen lots of rumors involving Logan Mayu, who's apparently already drawing interest from Winnipeg. But Mayu currently leads all defensemen in the OHL on goals. And I'd prefer to kind of hang on to him. So what I'm trying to say is, depending on what it takes to get him, I'd be absolutely fine with bringing Dubois into Montreal, okay? And I see a lot of people comparing Dubois to Drew Ann already. But man, these guys couldn't be any more different on the ice. Dubois is a beast. He brings so many more elements to his game. He's already hit 60 points a couple of times. He's gotten over 100 penalty minutes, so you know what that means. He's big, 28 goals last season, 25 so far this season, and most importantly, he's 24 years old, okay? He's just a pop. He's only one year older than Nick Suzuki, which means, of course, that moving forward, Pierre-Luc Dubois definitely fits the bill in Montreal, okay? What a piece to add to the core. Imagine a line of Nick Suzuki between Cole Caulfield and Pierre-Luc Dubois. I mean, there, there's no way that it doesn't work. How about Kirby Doc between Josh Anderson? and Pierre-Luc Dubois. Jeez, the options are just endless. And for me personally, I mean, this is not about him being French at all. I don't care if he's from Laval or Baghdad at this point. I'm on the outside looking in and I see a 24-year-old big scrappy player that's already putting up a lot of points in the NHL and apparently wants to play in Montreal. It's a bit of a touchy subject, but again, depending on the cast, I say go get him get him now sign him up and the rest is history so let me know in the comment section what you think of these rumors do you think that Pierre-Luc Dubois will be a member of the Montreal Canadiens soon or do you think that Elliot Friedman just ate a bad batch of hot dogs and doesn't know what he's talking about I want to hear all about it don't forget to slap the like button on the way out of here and hey I'll see you next time